hi hello everybody you're welcome to my channel today i'd like to tell you how i became a software engineer in canada without any education without any prior experience and with a guaranteed job on the spot okay. so the reason i'm sharing this is because the platform that i used um, to achieve this will be opening up and opening up application and taking new people for the next cohort very soon and I need for you to plug in if you're interested. Also, I'm going to be sharing with you some of the pro tips um, and what to expect after you have applied, what to expect in terms of yes. assessments and all of that, okay? So if you like this content and you also like other career specific contents, then I think you should subscribe to my channel and I'm gonna be right back. Welcome back. So I remember in July 2022 when we landed Canada, somebody posted on one of the groups. I mean, there are WhatsApp groups that has Nigerians in the WhatsApp group. Somebody posted a flyer that showed, you know, that you'd be paid $2,000 to be trained monthly for three months for software engineering. And after that three months boot camp, you have a guaranteed job at the end. To be honest, it felt like it was too good to be true. I didn't know what to make of that. My husband was the one who shared it with me and I just had to apply immediately just because I wasn't quite sure how Canada will be in terms of my career placements and all of that. And, and that's one of the things I kind of think is important for us to note is like when you're in a new country and you do not know how it's going to be yet, I think it's good for you to open up all the possibilities, right? Open up the possibilities so that you are expanding all the opportunities that are available to you per time. So I remember we applied and we, but eventually we got to discover that you needed to be in cities at the time. It was only, you needed to be in Ontario, about five different cities in Ontario, as well as Montreal for you to be eligible. And because we're in, in Calgary and we like it here, and we also just felt it wasn't time to move out of this place. And we don't even know if we want to move out of this place at all. So when we applied and we did the assessment and we got called, we, we had to defer, right? We had to defer the our spot. And I think it's quite kind enough um, of um, the Obsidi platform to actually give us that opportunity to defer. I think it was really a thoughtful thing to do. So we deferred our position in cohort one, deferred it as well in cohort two until Calgary opened up. And as soon as Calgary opened up, I remember just sending a mail to say, I'm ready now. It's just because you're in Ontario. That's why I've been deferring. And being so kind, they put me on the list for cohort two. I did the training from January till March and till April, yeah, end of January till April. And then I got the job automatically immediately after, just one week after the training. So um, guys, it's an incredible opportunity to be honest. This is one opportunity I didn't think was ever possible, but here is me telling you it's completely possible um, to have this kind of opportunity at your doorstep. If you are interested, and you're not just, you didn't just get a job in just any company, in a very major um, corporation in Canada. So if you're interested, I'm going to be putting the link. What you need to do is to sign up to the Obsidian Academy, the Obsidian Academy by P um, BPTN, Black Bull in Tech. Um, the founder is Leko Olawoye. Leko and his team are literally changing lives right now. I can tell you that. Um, so please go on the Obsidi platform. I'm going to put the link below. I'm also try going to try to put it on the screen. Sign up and make sure that your profile is up to 100%, okay? And then you go, so if you go on the platform already, I'm sure you probably already see information about um, the next cohort. Okay, I'm also going to share with you the link for the application. Now, I'm told, I know that application is supposed to open up in the middle of June, but I don't know how that would go. But even if application doesn't open up in the middle of June, and if there's, if cohort three is full, for example, because I really do not know, there will be cohort four. And I can just encourage you to make sure you just follow the um, Obsidi by P BPTN Academy, because there's going to be a whole lot um, coming from that platform 
for black people in technology okay so yes the program is black people specific and you know it's just of, of course um, the opportunity to improve the number of you know black people that we have in technology in Canada okay. so yes please you guys um, go there apply um, if the application is open apply if you are told that the application is not opened yet then just hold on a bit until application opens up okay um, the second thing I want to talk about is what you should expect after you have applied it's a pretty straightforward process to be fair very straightforward in that all you need to do is apply and then you'll be given an assessment if things don't change then this is how it worked for me at the time you'll be given an assessment It's usually a psychometric IQ test you know how those tests can be Nobody expects you to finish the assessment, but you'll be given a, sh a short time and the trick is to do as much as you can do within that short time. I remember that I think out of 50 questions, I finished 35 questions and I think I was sure of about 30 questions. So I don't know if that's what I got, but that was how I felt at the time, right? So I did 35 because you. I, I, if anybody finished um, that test, then I think you have a very, very high IQ and I doff my heart for you. But for me, out of the 50 questions, I remember doing 35. It's just the psychometric um, assessment where you have like different shapes and you are told to, you know, figure out the next direction or it's just simple mathematics, you know, just things that you can do very fast, but it's also a bit technical, you know. So if you're able to do that assessment and you do very well, in the assessment in the assessment you will be called you know you'll be told that you're moving on to the next stage and the next stage is really just submission of your documentation after which you'll be officially introduced into the cohort now if you officially get into the program it's a boot camp that's going to run for three months if you do not have any tech background let me just tell you it's going to be really um daunting but it's not something you cannot do i believe that the obsidian academy actually gave enough support system in terms of the instructors in terms of the model of learning which is you know the group work and all of that so i believe you know once you pass that assessment you do excellent on the job i mean you do excellent in the boot camp and if you do very well in the boot camp and you pass all the necessary background checks you're gonna get the job automatically right and oh i told you guys i was paid right yes we're paid 2000 Canadian dollars every month for the three months during the duration of this training. I don't know what else to say to Lekon and his team that put all this together, except to just say thank you for changing lives and thank you for putting other people first. And that's what I'm also trying to do here. It's like just open up the opportunity to as many persons who need that opportunity. Make sure you don't sleep on this. Make sure you hop on it and, you know, change your lot as it were in Canada if this is what you want. And I just want to talk to those who don't really know if this is what they want. Um, I just want to encourage you, right? Um, whether you've never seen yourself as somebody who should be in the technology space at any point in time, I think you should just give this a try. You absolutely do not have anything to lose and you have everything to gain, to be honest. So um, try to dip you know, your feet in many waters until you decide what you want to do for yourself, okay? So I believe this video has helped you. Um, thank you so much for watching everybody. I wanted it to just be a very quick, punchy um, video that talks about the OPCD, um by BPTN Academy, okay? Um, do apply and I'm wishing every one of you the very very best and I just want to say thank you again for joining me on my channel if you've not subscribed to my channel you agree with me that it's the least you can do for me right just um, apply I mean subscribe to my channel turn on the notification bell and let us take the career conversations going forward okay in the next video I'm going to try to talk about um, the high paying tech jobs in canada and globally at that okay so thank you so much guys and um, for today i'm gonna see you on the next episode of sessions with ella bye thank you